In a startling development from Iran, a helicopter carrying President Ebrahim Raisi and his foreign minister Hossein Amir Abdullahian has crashed in the mountainous northwest of the country. This unfortunate event deepens the ongoing turmoil that has been gripping the nation on multiple fronts. Here's what you need to know. The crash occurred near the city of Varzagan around 1 p.m. local time amidst bad weather and thick fog. The helicopter was navigating through challenging conditions with visibility severely compromised by rain and fog. This prompted a massive search and rescue operation involving over 40 teams, including foot soldiers and elite commandos of the Revolutionary Guards. Despite the adverse conditions, the search went on for more than 10 hours. In response to this crisis, Iran's Supreme Leader Ayatollah Ali Khamenei addressed the nation. He assured that the country's operations would not be disrupted. Senior officials are doing their work, he said, and I have advised them on the necessary points. All of the country's operation will carry on smoothly and orderly. This statement aims to stabilize the public sentiment and maintain governmental continuity. As the details continue to unfold, the international community watches closely. The stability of Iran is of significant interest not only to its citizens, but to the entire region and the world, given its strategic geopolitical position. This event could potentially have broader implications, affecting international relations and internal dynamics within Iran. Stay tuned as we continue to follow this developing story and bring you the latest updates. Thank you for watching and please take a moment to reflect on the day's events and stay informed.